some uh, 24 hours before the fight, most important part of Andrew's tomorrow performance, what will be? Uh, we, you know, we worked very hard in this camp. Um, he's, he's prepared for this fight. Now we just got to get him in the right frame of mind for fight time. You know, eat, eat rest, make sure he gets hydrated, and uh, we're ready to go. I mean, I'm not taking this fight lightly. We know we're going to go into war, and we're prepared for this. What he cannot do against Carpency tomorrow in the ring? Well, he can't take this guy lightly, you know. Uh, he can't depend on his power. We need combination, and then go for the, for the knockout. But until then, we need to put the punches together. You can't do it one punch. You've got to put them together. Carpency is, uh, is confident. Uh, uh, he said that Andrew's nine KOs in the last ten fights do not bother him. That he knows what, what he's supposed to do. Uh, it's easier said, said than, than done. Well, you know what? Uh, you know, a fighter can say whatever he wants. You know, but uh, you know, you know, this guy has gone to other people's hometown, so he's used to this atmosphere. He's used to being with the top guys. So, you know, he's, he's got a good game plan. You know, set, but we're going to overcome anything he does. Um, comparison to the fight. Uh, versus Glenn Johnson. Physically, Andrew looks the same. Mentally, he's the same. Can we expect the same kind of performance? Well, I think for this fight, Andrew's going to have to throw even more punches because this is a young guy that's hungry, that's young. Glenn Johnson, he had his best days behind him. So Glenn Johnson took this fight lightly. You know this guy is not taking it lightly. So I'm 